I am Mohammed Umair Mushtaq. I am an associate professor at University of Kansas Medical Center, and I treat uh, hematologic malignancies and uh, do cellular therapeutics. Uh, I'm presenting an abstract. It's our trial in progress regarding reduced dose lymphodepletion with fludarabine and cyclophosphamide before tumor infiltrating lymphocyte therapy in metastatic melanoma. So in highly pretreated metastatic melanoma patients who have progressed, the treatment options have been limited with a dismal prognosis. Autologous tumor infiltrating lymphocyte therapy with lifelucil was recently FDA approved after a high-dose fludarabine and cyclophosphamide lymphodepletion and high-dose interleukin-2 after the infusion. An overall response rate of 31% with durable responses were noted at four-year follow-up, 22% patients are still alive. Most of the toxicity, high-grade toxicity, comes from high-dose lymphodepletion. We think that a reduced dose of fluorabine and cyclophosphamide can lead to similar expansion of the tumor-infiltrating lymphocytes and similar efficacy with a reduced toxicity profile. Expanding this life-saving therapy to several melanoma patients and making it possible to deliver it in a safer way, maybe in outpatient setting. Uh, the, it is a phase two pilot study uh, and it will investigate low doses of fludarabine and cyclophosphamide before FT approved tumor infiltr infiltrating lymphocyte therapy with lifelucil with high dose IL-2. The primary this objective is to see the persistence of TILs at week six. Scannery objectives will include uh, survival, response rates, and duration of response, and other exploratory endpoints.